Hello YouTube, welcome to Renegade, welcome back to a whole new video. Today is going to be a different type of video. I got Renegade right here. I'm not going to ride it uh, just yet. I got a little small footage of yesterday, uh, but this time we're going to be doing something uh, pretty uh, incredible today. I mean, we outdoors. I love the outdoors. I love nature. Uh, rather it's forest, ocean, or any of that thing. I love it. And if you love it too, come over, join, and uh, let's grow together and let's continue to explore more places. Uh, help me, you know, get all the way across the country or so, something. Even though I'd probably go there now, but come on, come join. So, guys, for this part, it was really windy, so you really couldn't hear me. But, uh, she already dropped the basket down. The only thing we did is just added a piece of chicken because that's what they attracted to. And, uh, the water was pretty low, I felt like. But we was in some deep little parts, so yeah. So, guys, this is my favorite spot. Favorite spot. Renegade is where all the way over there, uh, parked up, safe, the sound. Um, but this is like a private community. So beautiful, immaculate outside. Decided to get this like little footage. I'm gonna get some footage off my phone. But man, look at this. I'm a girl over there. I'm gonna walk down. Yeah. Like you can literally just chill out here. Like especially summertime and stuff, man. It'll always be the best. I took pictures over there before, and I just you know hung out over here before, man. It's just so. Fine, okay. Little beers or something. If y'all drink beers or anything in that nature, man. Man, look at look at this. So beautiful, man. So beautiful. Look at that bridge. Just look, man. Anyway, I'm not gonna hold up too much. What I'm gonna do, I'm probably put this camera GoPro on my head. Got the Tahoe up top. I'm gonna put the GoPro on my head and probably do some crabbing my girlfriend she had an idea of saying put the gopro like in the net but i don't know how that will work i don't want to lose the gopro in the ocean and stuff but hey it is what it is guys it is what it is i'm feeling good feeling great came out here yesterday but with the uh, renegade and like i said just seen the introduction i told you all right guys so for this clip right here i'm just explaining um the time i went crabbing and what we're going to be doing uh, in this clip. Now, it was really windy, so I'm going to do a voiceover. Now, this is my third time crabbing at this uh, particular spot. Uh, first time we had crab here, uh, it was really great, immaculate. We had a whole bunch of crabs like to the cooler top. And I took crabs home, cooked it. Now, it was pretty fun and scary experience because I had crabs trying to fight at me when I tried to get them out. One was trying to hold on to the damn stove for dear life, and it was trying to snap at me. But other than that, uh, second time, we ain't really caught nothing. This time, y'all going to see if we caught uh, anything. Now, I have bought a fishing pole for a reasonable price. Uh, it was a sea striker from Walmart. I was going to go to the Badge Pro Shop, probably get like a, a Spencer one. But then I said, why do that if I really don't go fish or anything like that? But if y'all know anything about fishing poles, y'all let me know what's like the best uh, fishing pole. And do y'all go fishing? Do y'all do any other hobbies like hunting and all that? This is my favorite spot, uh, especially for crabbing and all that. Y'all let me know. Y'all let me know. But anyway, bro, look at these birds. Like, they trying to fly, but they really can't because the wind is so goddamn strong. Every time I get by water, especially, you know, sea, it's always windy. It's always blowing. Especially after a bad storm, like, it gets bad. But, uh, yeah. So peaceful out here, man. So crazy. This basket, real quick.
Now, if you're going to do crabbing, you got to be really quiet. Don't be like me trying to drag a chair across and make noise. But yeah. So unfortunately, our fishing pole line got all tangled up, as you can see. But I ended up fixing it uh, later on and everything was going smooth. I also moved the crab basket down to see if we could get any crabs uh in like another uh section now i did have something bite on my fishing pole but man they would take the fish and they won't hook so i'm gonna go change this hook to a better one i felt some tug on there but So guys, today it's pretty bit slow. Like the tide look pretty low. Usually the water be about right there. You can actually see it. Whatever. But we didn't catch that. Trying to check on this little crab basket right here. And uh, yeah. But it ain't really done. You said it come on the hot tide, right? Usually. But well, the water uh, felt warm though when I touched it. She said it don't mean anything, but usually if you have like low, low tide, I mean, you just ain't gonna catch nothing. So you gotta have like pretty decent uh, hot tide or whatever. But nah. Uh,